guys, Jen here from Million and Suds and Such and Be Scented Fragrance All Supply. I'm restocking my oatmeal milk and honey soap. I know, I'm like completely sold out. Crazy, but you know, oh well. Oats, my oatmeal, my kale and clay, and my goat milk is already in my oils. I just added my cream, which is part of my milk. <laughs> ground oats that I'll put in in here in just a minute. And I almost forgot my honey. Hold on guys. Okay, I'm back. I've got my honey down in my fragrance. Alright, in with my lye. I'm going to go ahead and add my titanium dioxide. I always do this to this bar just to help lighten it up some. Because it goes through a really heavy gel. And with the cream and the milk that's in there and the honey. It just heats up. So, we'll go ahead and add our ground oats in there. It helps be lightly exfoliating. our honey out. Give that a nice blend. Just want to make sure we get that honey dispersed in there good. thickens up because this is all I do. Alright. Smells really good. It is oatmeal milk and honey fragrance. Yummy yummy. Get this poured. I'm going to give this a tap down. I'm going to pause you guys because it's still really fluid. I'm going to take sure the top a little bit. So I'm going to pause you guys and bring you back. Okay guys, I'm going to try adding a strip of bubble wrap. I've never done this before. I've seen lots of people do it. So I want to try it. And my soap is just now setting up. I didn't want it all the way across the whole thing. Let's see. Now 
Okay. Now let me get a little spoon. Okay guys, we'll catch you on the tin here for main and such and such and be scented. This is my oatmeal milk and honey soap. It still has the, sh the bubbles on top. I thought I would um, show you guys taking them off. I've never done this before. And so, you know, I thought I could bring you along with me as I, I did that. And we can see how it does. But um, I've actually been out of stock. Um, I sold my last bar of oatmeal milk and honey soap about a week ago. So I'm just going to grab a corner of it. I'll go back on this end, grab the corner of it. Voila! And none of my bubbles busted. So, technically, if I wanted to, I could sit this up, you know, put this up and save it and use it for another bar because none of my bubbles busted. Coolness. But there you go. So, let's. Hi. 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 <laughs> Silly boy. That's what I'm doing. I'm doing. What am I doing? Cutting soap. So there it is cut. That's how it looks. I love it. Got a little bit of texture Bye. on this side and then the Bye. little bubbles. Bye. 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 I love I love you too. I love it. How cool is that? Um, I've seen a lot where a lot of people do the whole thing. Um, and I just, you know, thought I'd do it a little bit differently and do half the top with the bubbles. You know. I know people probably have done that too. <laughs> it's not my original idea. Excuse me, had a hiccup. But that's just awesome. I really like it. You can see the little pieces of oatmeal in there. That this bar will be gently exfoliating. It has honey, it has goat milk, it has cow's cream. Um it's a nice light scent. The oatmeal milk and honey is a very nice light scent. Um, just a fantastic bar. Oh, it smells very yummy. But yeah, I put colloidal oatmeal, kale and clay, I uh, grind uh, oats in a coffee grinder, put those in there. This is just like one of those soaps that is just luxurious and yummy for our skin. And it's a favorite.
There's the only color I put in here is I add a little bit of titanium dioxide because it goes through a full heavy gel and um, the honey that's in there can cause the soap to darken really dark. So I add just a little bit of titanium dioxide to lighten it up just a little bit. I like the creamy color. that I do plain. Y'all know me. I love color. And I love design to play. And I guess that's why, you know, when you have a plain bar of soap, you know, the least you can do is play and color, or play with the top of it. Make the top look good. So, let's get this cut in half so we can have our samples and there we go so I thank you all very much for watching if you're interested in purchasing any of my products the information is in the description box below feel free to join my group where I sell my soaps um, I have two groups I have one group where I sell my soaps and body care products and then I have one group where I sell supplies for soap makers. Uh, so don't get the two confused. One is Be Scented Fragrance Oil Supply. Pretty easy there. The other one is A&N and Suds and Such. You know, totally different names. Totally different, um... What are you doing? Totally different reasons for the groups. So thank you all very much. I hope to catch Bye. you on my next Bye. video. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.